DSM price monitor reprices the listing final price according to changes made in the source price. The monitor scans prices once an hour and along with the monitoring option enables you to control and optimize your listings. The price monitor is full of different features and it is being updated all the time to support the ongoing changes in the different marketplaces. Let's get to know the different features of the monitor. The quick search box enables you to rapidly locate an item from the list by entering the item's ID on the relevant marketplace. You can enter an eBay ID, Amazon ASIN, Walmart ID, etc. Below you will find the view options. You can set the number of items viewed on a single page starting from 25 items per row, per page, to all items. On the top right corner of the price monitor page, you will see when was the last time the price monitor scanned your listings. A quick link to the price monitor setting appears in the right top corner as well. Filtering the list is also possible by any type of data such as price, destination, etc. Simply click on the filter list link, fill in the relevant data and click filter. Click on any column to order the list by the parameter. For example, if you click on the days count, the table will order itself from the oldest to the newest. Click on it again and it will order it the other way around. Each row in the monitor represents a list with its source and destination data. Put your mouse over the small image to enlarge it. Click on the item's title to go to the item on eBay. The source section shows data taken from the source marketplace. Locate your mouse over the item's ID to view its title in the source marketplace. In this example, you can see the item title on Amazon.com. Clicking on the item ID will lead you to the source item page. You can view the name of the source, the source price, and the current quantity of the item on the source marketplace. On the destination marketplace part, you can view the destination, in our example eBay.com, you can view the destination ID or click on it to navigate to the items page. Next to it is the final price and the quantity on the destination. In a, case, in a case that an item has gone out of stock, it will go into protected mode and its quantity will immediately reduce to zero by the monitor and a lock will appear next to its destination quantity. You can set the different parameters to set when to enter a list to protected mode, depending on the source marketplace you use in the account settings page. Your estimated profit is presented on the monitor as well. This is not a final profit, rather an estimation made by DSM tool. Your final profit depends on the actual fees and taxes tax taken from you during the sale process and could be viewed in your PayPal or other payment method account. You can follow your list performances on eBay and, other, and later on other marketplaces using the views, watch and sold count. We also calculate your list conversion rate by dividing the sold amount by the views amount. The days counter will enable you to follow the amount of time your list has been on air. To control better the listings, your listings on air, you can add a note to each list by clicking on the yellow note icon. A window will appear with the note edit options. Fill in your note and click update. When an item holds an, a note in it, a bell icon appears next to the list selection box. To edit a single list details. Click on the blue edit icon. You can edit the item's source and target ID by clicking on the edit button. 
change the item title, break even percentage, desired profit percentage and quantity at the destination. After updating the details, click update and the item details will be updated on DSM price monitor at the destination marketplace, in our case ebay.com. When you wish to delete a list, click on the red trash can icon and multiple choices will appear. You can remove the item from the monitor and keep it on eBay. In that case, you will have to manually monitor the price yourself. You can end the listing on eBay and keep it for future relisting in the monitor. Listings that are being kept in the monitor for future relisting do not count in your total listing amount and you do not pay for them. When an item is being deleted from eBay but stays in the monitor, a released option will appear next to its quantity at the destination. You can also delete an item from the monitor and end the listing on eBay as well at the same time. Or end the listing and immediately release it to keep your account fresh for future activity. Renewing the items who are not selling changing the profit or quantity in bulk and other multiple items actions are daily maintenance activities of the dropshipper. To perform bulk operations, such as mentioned, select the listings you wish to affect. You can see the percentage of, your, of the total amount of listings you have selected on the top left corner. On the right top corner, the bulk options will reveal. To edit multiple items at once, click on the blue pencil icon. You can set a different quantity of all of the items, increase profit rate by typing a positive number or decrease profit by typing a negative number. Click update to perform the actions in bulk. When clicking on the red trash can icon, bulk deleting options are being shown. Note that these are the same delete options we saw earlier in the single listing delete option. Below the monitor table, global operations appears. The find unmonitored listings will scan your eBay account and find listings that are listed on eBay but are not monitored on DSM tool. You can see the items ID and an add button. Clicking on the Add button will open another global operation feature, the ex Add Existing Listings, which you can also reach rapidly from the Global Operations menu. When clicking on the Add button, the Listings ID is copied to the ID line in the Add Existing Listings feature automatically. Choose the correct destination of the item and enter the source items URL, for example, the items URL on Amazon or Walmart, and click Add Item. The listing will be added immediately to the price monitor. If you are moving to DSM tool from a different repricing tool, click on the Import All Listings from another monitor, or the Import Listings icon on the top right corner of the website and follow the instructions. A tutorial video will be waiting there as well. Bulk listing is another global operation you can reach from the global operations menu. For more information, watch the video in the bulk listing page by clicking on the question mark at the top right corner of the page. If you release an item on eBay, instead of releasing it in the monitor, we cannot track it. If you do so, Please use the Sync Relisted Listings button at the Global Operations menu buttons.